Now, the Royal Albert Hall in London is one of the most prestigious venues for musicians. Over the years, the Beatles, Bob Dylan, and more recently Adele have performed there. But tonight, children from the Essex-based disability charity, The Music Man Project, will be taking centre stage. They've been rehearsing today, and Stuart Woodward went along to watch. The Music Man Project has come a long way since its Royal Albert Hall debut in 2019. Based in Southend, the charity's now expanded across the UK, establishing 14 regional teaching centres and showcasing the talents of thousands of musicians with learning disabilities. After touring the country and a top 10 Christmas single, they're back at the Albert Hall again, bigger and better, with a military band and the backing of musical and stage legend Michael Ball, the charity's patron. I know how they're feeling. I know that, that you know they've been working hard, they've been rehearsing hard. It's a bit overwhelming, but we're all there together. And it's, it's the most exhilarating feeling for them and for me. Uh, and the joy is writ large on their faces. It's a huge event. We've got a total of 800 people involved in this production. 700 performers will be on the stage behind me, um, including 250 musicians from Music Man Projects from across the country uh, that have got learning disabilities. So really, this is the climax of really five years of, of amazing achievement for the community that I work with. Tonight's concert is bolstered by His Majesty's Band of the Royal Marines, with whom the charity has established a long-term partnership. I feel absolutely honoured I was asked to conduct, having sort of founded the collaboration with um, uh, David, um, and so to be able to conduct here also alongside my husband, who's conducting um, the rest of the show, is, is exciting. With just hours to go, the excitement's starting to build. I'm a little bit nervous, but I'll be fine. I'll have my uncle Pat and my uncle Tony coming down from Wales to come down to see me here. Coming all the way from Wales? Yes. Oh, wow. That's going to be fantastic to see I them know. in the audience. I Olympics. can't believe it. I just like just do it, like doing it. And I'd like to be with David and do all these tricks with him and do these concerts, being here with Apple Hall again, with the Royal Marines. And I just... You're in lovely and be join, doing it. Each and every one of you must be bursting with pride at what these people have achieved tonight. The Music Man project was championed by the late MP for South End West, Sir David Amos, who famously declared they're destined for Broadway. Perhaps with Michael Ball on board, those dreams may finally be realised. Stuart Woodward, BBC Look East, at the Royal Albert Hall.